Alright, hey guys, I am back for another Golf Clash tutorial video here. And you are going to see me with this wind. I will just... Mm, I don't know, this isn't the easiest shot to pull off. I am going to go about 5 backspin here. And you can kind of see my aim. You know, I'm going to keep it a little bit long and to the left. In addition to that, I am going to go about... Uh, you know, a couple extra rings here, um, at least nine rings here. In addition to playing the extra rings, I'm going to make sure that, uh, you know, I kind of curl it to the left here to kind of counter the effects and make this ball come in at the pin. And you can see it's kind of shooting right there. It just came in about a yard, a yard too fast, but on a very good line. You see, when, you're, when you have the wind like that, um, you just got to... Uh, Especially if you don't have side spin. So another thing you can do is about three side spin to counter that. Um, if you basically put it um, like in line with the hole there and then use about three side spin after you had it lined up on the hole, that would basically counter that wind. You wouldn't have to do any curl. It would be basically equivalent to what I just did. But uh, you need to do something to kind of counter that wind when it goes in the direction or whatever you know you have to always be thinking to counter your wind and bring it in a little bit differently depending on how the wind is and just keep that in mind I think you'll be able to get in there pretty tight on this hole um, make sure that you're going you know an extra 20 percent on whatever the wind adjustment is so in that situation I forget what the wind was maybe it was a seven which would bump me up to about um, and maybe it was an 8 wind. I think it was about 8, which would pull it up to about 9.5 with 20% extra. And then, you know, aside from that, I basically played it uh, relatively close to, uh, you know, 9 rings there on top of that. And more so, it's kind of like going the 8 that I would usually go. Um, and then just go 1 extra because. So, so I need to correct for, you know, the ball stopping a little bit more abruptly. So you saw me go just a little bit too much there. Um, and like I said, you know, had I gone probably eight rings, it would have probably been spot on. So it's kind of what happens when you're uh, rushing a little bit. But, uh, you know, the, the more practice you get and, uh, of course, you know, the more flow you get being in a tour, the easier wins become I was kind of stuck between two shots I was about to carry it onto the green I wasted like 10 seconds looking at that and then had to go and readjust and do around my five backspin four to five backspin method that you saw me actually end up hitting so kind of cost me a little bit of time but uh, overall I think uh, you know if I can get you in the right vicinity uh, you'll be able to do your minor corrections on your own. So good luck with that and be on the lookout for my other shootouts. So good luck.